just because I'm short, just because I'm a tiny man, a little, <laughs> tiny, mini, small man. Well, I'm just a big, stupid asshole. Stinks of ass. <laughs> <laughs> and welcome to Sounds Like, the only panel show that's all about rhyme. I am your host of the panel show. I'm repping it with y'all, rhyming every syllable, and I'm relatively tall. It's Shuffle T. What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? Yeah, joining me as Hello. always in Rhyme Square. It's too easy to spit it greasy, rich and creamy, a little greasy, looks into species. It's Mr. Bleasy. How you doing? <laughs> you all right? Yeah, I'm all good, man. We've got some legends in the house today. I mean... They stand like farmer scarecrows with their battle bars and skilled raps. It's Badal Nan Fierro, Kamikaze and Il Mac. Mm. Let's go. Scarecrow Jesus. is particularly good for what's going on with Nan Fierro's hair at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> I like what you did there. Right, you got any, uh, any warm-up rhymes to start us off? Because I think Nan's just woken up. So we've got some... Yeah. I want to get people's brains going. If I said the scheme was Pepperami, Federali, uh, Epsom Derby, I've got three more in that scheme, right? So the first clue is uh, you have this when you get married. Uh, wedding party? Wedding party. Wedding party. Mm. Wait, this is a warm-up, right? This is just a warm-up, mate. No yeah, 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 yeah. Wedding. Flipping out. <laughs> Come on, man. I need oh, you. Oh, yeah. Man. So we had wedding party on the same scheme, American singer-songwriter. Uh, Where's the funny? Mm. Let's go. Come on, Cal. Fire. And also... So on the same scheme, Gwen Stefani. Then we got a hip hop rock band. Oh, that's a good one. Lankin Parky. Into <laughs> 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 uh, Shikari. No, oh, that's close, isn't it? Close. It's not bad. No. A hip hop rock band. Yeah, and it's not Ken and Barbie either. <laughs> <laughs> it's not. You guys don't know enough about Team Backpacks to you know Dev did. Dev Tejwani, so that no, is it. it. Um, I felt like I was hard up for this, but now I feel like wet salami. Um, go on, please, put them out there. Thanks, Ed Starby. No, 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 no. All right, so, so clue Pharrell. Oh, no, Neptune's uh, something. I think, yeah, but NERD. N-E-R-D. Oh, my -E God. Oh, what? my God. That's nerd. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> That's nerd. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, now we've got some amazing guests with us today, so let's get on with the wank traductions. Fuck being over here, the party's there, bro. With his half-prepared flows, when he lifts his hands, his armpit hair grows. It's not the arrow. Mm. That's a fact of life. Hello. <laughs> Thank you for hey, having me. Right? Yeah, I'm, I met you in uh, 2014, and you don't remember. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I remember. No, you don't. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's why I'm going to win. You were the one who did the, uh, you did the raps, didn't you? You did, you did the raps. Yeah. Damn, I remember. remember. Come on. Let's raps. go. Was it in America that we met? No. Yeah, see, I remember. I said it's not in America, was it? Yeah. <laughs> no, we, did. we met We met in Compton, bro. <laughs> so, yeah. I was out there on a day trip. <laughs> we bumped into each other. Next up, we've got a little chap. He hasn't got any skill in rap. Pretty crap. It's Illy Mac. <laughs> hey, that's that's pretty good, man. Yeah, uh, my apologies on the cam if uh, my jewelry's too lit, you know. But <laughs> I just want to say, stop with Push the Tom Fury bullshit. I don't usually do this. Yeah. Real rap. It's Ill Mac. It used to be you lit. What's pop? <laughs> How you doing, man? You good? You're hey. supposed to rhyme the whole time? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Listen to his tunes at a party, pulling up in his Maserati. You'll see his name spelt wrong if you're a grammar Nazi. It's British rap man Kamikaze. Yeah. I like that. that. A I like that. Oh, Nazi was fun. I don't have a Maserati, though. Oh, I thought but... that's what you're in. It's got the inter same interior as a Maserati. <laughs> oh, it's an Audi. It's an Audi. Oh, that's cool. It's, it's an, an Audi. It's an Audi. It's a black Ferrari. <laughs> <laughs> not an ass the mind. How you doing, man? You all right? <laughs> yeah, man. No, I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm very good. Yeah. 
Now, his name is Liam Bagnall. He's part of the show called Liam Bagnall. The man's name is Liam Bagnall. It's the man himself, Liam Bagnall. How are you doing, mate? That is the least effort you've put in since you just now it's not even introduced me. To be fair, he did still match all the syllables there, so. I've always said nothing rhymes better than the word itself. Nothing is more clean as a rhyme. <laughs> Like Round one is Rhymes in the Wild. This is where each contestant is charged with finding two items that make the best rhymes they can in real life from around the houses. Please, can you give us an example, please? Okay, here we go. So, <clears throat> my first item here is a, it's a Comfort Quest, which is a single, not a double bed. <laughs> Jeez. And here I have a half a dozen eggs. And there's only a couple left. <laughs> <laughs> now, first of all, Nan Fierro. What, what's a good nickname we can have instead? Of, I don't want to say Nan Fierro every five minutes. There's too many syllables. It's Nan. 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 Yeah. Nan. Nan. Not Nan. Nan over here is a uh, a type of bread that you get in an Indian meal. Yes, it is. Excellent. All right. You I'll... pronounce it exactly the same. Can I call you Kima. <laughs> is that it, like yeah. a Nan or a or a Peshwash? Can I call you Peshwari? Garlic. Molly. Parata. The best. Yeah. All right. What's your rhyme in the wild? Have you got one for us? But maybe soon, maybe soon as I take this eighth of shrooms, start gazing at this amazing doom art. Woo! Good. And I might feel the effects in my little achy, breaky sailor moon heart. Yeah, I cheated. <laughs> <laughs> Three items. But, but the shrooms was a transition, low key, kind of. Mm. Well, just imagine I didn't show the shrooms. Two items in a prop. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Showing <laughs> off drug usage, if anything, which isn't cool. It isn't I don't take I don't take those. They're just for right. like I just keep them here. Drugs. It's lion's mane, man. Uh, Look at them. <laughs> There's kids who watch this and they're gonna be very disappointed. Yeah. Very no. disappointed. <laughs> okay, Jill Macula. What have you been up to, mate? What's what's your day-to-day -day at the moment? Uh man, streaming, uh full time twitch.tv slash illmac. Lately I've been chilling a little bit off that, but then uh working on cartoons and music. Yeah, so but I like three projects in the last year. How's the cartoon stuff going? Good, man. We're actually like in the process of repitching rap off. That was like ketchup versus mustard, yeah, yeah, kind of yeah. fashioned it into a full show. Actually working with Twist on that. Oh sick. And yeah, yeah, he's like writing it with me, turning into like outside of the battles, like an actual show. Get holes in your leather jacket, get the ratchet, some squirting if I see ketchup packet and rip his top open like a ketchup packet. You be with the french fries, tater tots, I be on sandwiches in the spread. Translation, you small potatoes and I'm out here getting to the bread. Have you thought about shortening it down to sort of two and a half minute long things and interspersing it among sort of like, I don't know, a panel show about rhyme or something like that that's kind of specific to it. And then that panel show, whatever one it is, could sort of benefit from the views that you... <laughs> Have you thought about that? Oh. Uh, yeah, actually, me and Twiz talked extensively about it and <laughs> weighed, uh, weighed the um, cons and... <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't find a pro, but you know. What's your rhyme in the world? Oh, uh, I don't really have one, but uh, we'll just off go off the top, you know. Sure, why uh, not? <laughs> the thing is, is I had I had grandiose plans. Um, I was actually gonna make uh, I was actually gonna make a plate for the scheme. Right. Eggs, Florentine, but I didn't want to. Uh, <laughs> I didn't want to hear uh, they forced it, please. So uh, I have this. I don't know what it's called, but uh, it to you. basically you take coffee bean. <laughs> you take all the beans. It makes coffee and it's got this great pouring thing. Um, <laughs> sorry, in my house, I'm searching. He's gone. He's chickened out. This is shaky at best. This is shaky ground. This this is is I like how he didn't know it was called a cafetiere as well. <laughs> uh, rainforest theme. <laughs> <laughs> you destroyed your fucking house to get that joke. Yeah. 
And it was yeah. called a cafetiere, so I, I would, I'd ask for points to be deducted, if anything. Oh. Uh, as if there's any points to give, I mean. No, well, it's a, I, it's I don't a, know if that counts. It's a great counts. porn thing. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone got a rhyme for cafetiere? Nah, man, you had to be there. Hey, there we go. Animal hair. I have some of that. Yeah, sit back. All right, kamikaze. Um, in your track, Time It Took, you say, if I think you're hard, I'll tell you. So first question is, do you think I'm hard? <laughs> yeah, I was actually trying to compliment you before we started. You have a bar that's one of my favorite bars ever. Go on. Um, no, being real. Yeah, I know. Like, you in, a, in a rap battle context, anyway. Um, <laughs> it's the one about the uh, shuffle T. I put the subtle B in subtle T or so, mm. something along them lines, innit? It was like that. So, I remember there you sort go. Of writing that half an hour before the battle, just cruising. Up <laughs> yeah, yeah, as you do. Yeah, man. Get over on the spot. You know, I always like to throw in a bit of freestyle in my battle, so that was just one of them. No, yeah. I appreciate that, mate. Thank you very much. What have you been up to? Obviously, uh, on Wednesday, I dropped Wavy Shirt Wednesday 2, which is a sequel to um, a project I dropped four years ago, which is a bit like a cult classic with my fans. So I felt like I had to full circle it, bring it back round. But it's a bit different now. Like My life's a bit different from what I was living four years ago. Yeah. Um, recently became a dad. Um, Amazing. Congratulations. So it's it's effectively the same approach in terms of the 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 beats and the feel of the tape, but a different approach in terms of what I'm talking about. All right, sick. And have you got a rhyme in the wild for us? Yeah, I mean, I seen some of the when I seen the trailer, I seen some mad. It's like 19 syllable rhymes with things that you you know what I mean. They're not they're not in your house, in it. <laughs> um, <laughs> So, so I know I went, I went simple, and this is the thing: it will work in my accent, but it might not work in yours. Oh. So, I've got a toothbrush and a juice cup. <laughs> simple, like it. Simple. Uh, you know, what I mean, simplicity sometimes works best. So I got a toothbrush and a juice cup. Effective. I like it. Yeah. Interact as well. You can put the tooth, toothbrush Trip in the fruit cup if you wanted, and then that's a rhyme within a rhyme. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I ain't too fussed. No. <laughs> And Bagnall, Bagnall, I've been doing a bit of re-watching um, over a few of our old episodes, and I've noticed that now and then you get yourself a bit down, and you, you're worried that you're not good enough, or that you're really shit, or that no one likes you and stuff, and I'm just wondering if you've got some, like, self-esteem issues that need oh, an attack. So I want to do some occupational therapy exercises. First of all, yep. um, I got these from, online, from a trusted therapist, so right. um, just tell me what you see when you look at this Warshark test? A dick. Oh my God. <laughs> I, see, a, I see a dick. Okay. Should we just get to my rhyme in the wild? It's just a face. It's just a face. See, that's the nose of the eyes. Oh, sorry, it's a bit blurry yeah. because you've got shit webcams <laughs> always. <laughs> what, what's that? Um, it looks a bit like a vagina, yeah. It looks... <laughs> yeah. Okay. That reason. A vaginal it's reason. It's a petal with two dewdrops either side. Right. <laughs> and what about this one? <laughs> uh, it looks like the Monopoly man's moustache and eyes about a monocle on. No, it's a pair of tits. Right. Sure. Okay. <laughs> right. Well, I'll take those away and see what they say at the... Um... Okay. Oh, could you keep updated yeah, so cool. I can stay with that, please? No problem. What's your rhyme in the wild? Uh, it's funny that Blees, Ble me and Blees are often in tune. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to change mine actually last minute because I was going to say that I had um, free range eggs and a VHS. And it's weird That's that you good. have that. But you're not going to say that, no? No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Mine was clearly better. So you know what I mean? So <laughs> I actually have a Slipknot videotape. A Slipknot and, videotape, right? And a pick of Billy No Mates. <laughs> <laughs> Slapped it. <laughs> Fire. Whitewash. A pick of Judge it how you will. I think we will, actually. I think we fucking will. I, I, I remember at Bagno was really against the phone usage. It uh, keeps cutting off, man. Yeah, oh, during the uh, Marlowe episode, actually. Oh. Very fucking true. I really appreciate you for watching, Ilmac. I really appreciate you for watching. <laughs> uh, we love that you like the show. Can we, can we go on to the judging? They've gone about and found items and they're so damn proud. But come along, please. Who owned that round? As always, if you could start, mate, with last place. <laughs> 
That is travesty. <laughs> that is absolute <laughs> robbery. You should have just stayed with the eggs. That's, That's plagiarism, eggs. though. Yeah, yeah. First you bit something and then you used your phone. Come on, man. That is crazy. Mm. Uh, Bill might exactly call the cafetiere something like a coffee was pouring. <laughs> <a bacon. laughs> Come on. Presentation. Not one of us thought he was going to come back in with a fucking shower curtain. Like, <laughs> I brain for I had my Steve. expectations. I had my, my suspicions. All right, who's who's third place then, please? Um, yeah, just for that presentation, I am going to put Ilmac in third. To be fair, <laughs> that's the biggest robbery. No. That's not a big robbery. You're you're lucky with that's third. the best one ever on this show. <laughs> <laughs> I had to go dismantle. I dismantle that off my wall. It's, it's the funniest one I've seen easily. Easily, the funniest <laughs> one, but yeah. What is this a serious? This ain't a serious rap show. Very <laughs> serious. Who does this hip hop? It, it, it literally, it's literally the best at what the ca the category that this show is. That's what. <laughs> that's what you just told me. Huh, interesting. Come on. All right, then I'm gonna go Kamikaze third. I'm gonna uh, second Non Fierro, my baby hey. first boy. Now, as we go through this week's episode, we're gonna be monitoring Twitter as well because we have a challenge for everyone watching at home to work on as we go through this episode. So whomever can come up with the best rhyme for Fourth of July, since it is that, will be our multilinguist of the week. So get on Twitter and use the hashtag Sounds Like Show, and we'll be retweeting and we'll announce the winner at the end. But before that. <laughs> <laughs> it's round two. What does it sound like? <laughs> Sounds like a multi to me. What does it sound like? Sounds like a multi to me. Wow, woo, it's round two, the quick fire rhyme game, y'all. This is where I will give a team a word or words and then a clue as to what rhymes with that word. You can't come up with just any rhyme, you have to get the one from the clue. So if the rhyme scheme was more to remember and the clue was immaculate's not bad, then the answer would be thesaurus is better. So we're going to start with Bagno <laughs> and Kamikaze. Do you two have a team name? The winning team. Yes. <laughs> mm. That is our name. That nice. Is our name. I like the ironic vibes. <laughs> For real. <laughs> like if Nan called himself Tiny, it's cute. I like it. Yeah, I am Tiny, actually. Yeah, I went by um, Talls. No. <laughs> yeah, that's that's right. who we are. Big and tall is our team. <laughs> tall and small. Right, small so and tall. Cool. You're going to have two minutes to answer as many as you can. You can skip if you don't know, but give it a go, though. I'm going to start in three Two, one, go. All right, Nightshade, psychological tricks. Mind games. Ooh, you love to see it. Sasquatch, laptop. What? Sasqu Sasquatch is the rhyme and laptop is the clue. But laptop also Mac rhymes with it. Yeah. Not just that good. Macintosh, Macintosh. No, it's not Macintosh. <laughs> Mac Mac skip, 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 skip. Fuck Mac skip. Skip it. All right, West Africa, mythical sword. Excalibur. Excalibur. Oh, yeah, yeah. Stylish interview where rappers rap, particularly in the UK. Stylish interview. Oh, rhyming in the room. Um, oh, you're fire the... in the booth. Yes, there we go. I've got right the best now. one ever. Thank you. All right, plastic container. <laughs> Butcher and Baker. Huh? <laughs> plastic container. And the clue is Butcher and Baker. Ice cream maker. Downtown maker. What? Ice cream <laughs> container. <laughs> Huh? Ice cream container. No, plastic container. And then the oh. it was butcher and baker and the... The butcher, the baker, the... Yeah, skip. Hand cream maker. Skip, skip, skip. Hand skip. cream maker, you... <laughs> skip. Breakneck <laughs> speed. Next. Music shop. Breakneck huh? speed, what? Breakneck speed. And the clue is music shop. HMV. HMV. <laughs> All right, paid smoke, paid spokesman. Classical musician. Beethoven. Yes! All right, we're going now. Kamikaze, the big finish. Get ready for the... After party. After party. Oh, Not bad. Give it to you. I think I'm going to give it to you. All right, earlobe. How many good rhymes has Bagnall come up with on Sounds Like? Zero. Correct! All right. Transit van, a couple bikes and stretched hummers. Three Will Ferrell films. That again is transit vans, a couple bikes and stretched hummers. Step Brothers. Um, transit van, a couple bikes, and stretch hummers. 
Skip. I'm fine. Magic Mike. Time. He's not in that one. All right. Not bad. You got seven. Oh, Anchor Man. Oh, my oh. days. And the, and the other guys. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, guys. please tell them what they missed. Tell okay, what they missed. to be fair, this one was we haven't done one like this before. So Sasquatch, and it was laptop, and it's caps lock. Not me. No, fuck. I, I would have said MacBook. MacBook. <laughs> <laughs> MacBook. It's like when you can have hashtag and backslash. Do you know what I mean? It's all relevant. You know what I'm saying? No. Uh, yeah, plastic <laughs> container. The butcher, the baker. Candlestick maker. Oh okay. uh, yeah. I forgot that. Mm-hmm. that. Is that like a a, a, a yeah, British like, like lullaby or what? Yeah, nursery rhyme you hear. Child is school. out like a light. Uh, but ask uh, my granddad that one. I don't know that. Kamikaze. You I don't leave this room. You killed it with after party, but it was grand finale. That's good. Mm-hmm. That was sick. I, I counted. I counted after party. Yeah, though, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just saying, the other one was that one. Yeah. Then there. Uh, yeah, transit vans, a couple bikes, and stretched Hummer. Will Ferrell films. It was, yeah, other Anchorman. Brothers. Anchorman. Step the other guys. The other guys. Step brothers. That's great. So, that, that's that. Do we get all American references? You actually do. All right, fire. So the first one is school shooting. I'm joking. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Ilmac and Nan, do you have a team name? Ilero. Ilero. Do you have to, you have to, no, you have to do the, Tongue wrong. You have to Get throw it. 15 R's. In. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Oh, you know, Frankie Fraser, he said um, that I had to tell you, Nan Fierro, that you got uh, the Canyonero from The Simpsons. I, I actually did make that rhyme the other day while I was talking to myself. <laughs> <laughs> Again, two minutes. I'm going to count you in. Three, right. two, one, go. Senior citizen, female tennis star that retired this week. Serena Williamson. <laughs> Skip. <laughs> you know it. Oh, what is it? You got, you got it. I watch tennis. I don't know. All tennis. right, fine. Bar for bar. Pokemon. Charizard. Charizard. Gerard. Gerard. <laughs> Taxi driver. U.S. translation of a dummy. <laughs> Taxi driver. U.S. A translation dummy. of a dummy. A baby might suck on. Massive winker. Pacifier. Fuck. Yeah. That's the fire. There we go. All right. Drunk driver. Type of beer. Budweiser. Budweiser. Yes. All right. What's your name Horrible and address? Beer. WRC 06 finalists. What's your name and address? What's his face and possessed? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know what to say. You're correct. In the rain. Method Man song. In the rain. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's also the song. Rain. Ooh, come on, uh, Pat, skip. Skip, 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 skip. All right, gentlemen, Jack. What do Nan Fierro's Diadoras look like? Mexican flag. Correct. Damn, you, you <laughs> heard that song? All right, capital I. A cartoon TV show that doesn't have one of those in its title. Family Guy. Correct. Mm. Again. All right, final plan. Movie director. Michael Mann. <laughs> Go. Pete, baby. Got some new games on my Xbox, which isn't healthy or pretty. Three baseball teams. That's got some new games on my Xbox, which isn't healthy or pretty. Boston Dodgers, Blue, Blue Jays. Boston, okay. Uh, yeah, Toronto. Dodgers, Blue Jays. No Dodgers. No Dodgers? Oh, what's Blue the full name? Toronto Blue Jays. Yeah. Toronto Blue Jays. What's the next? Xbox. Uh, Boston Red, Red Sox. Sox. Yeah. Which Boston isn't healthy or pretty. Oh, time, time. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Time. How did you say Serena Williamson? It's Serena Williams. Oh, Williams? Who says Williams? That's her name, bro. She says it. It's her name. It's Williams. I was close with the Williams. Like, you're not going to give it now because it's Williams son, he said. No. That. No, what are you talking about? There? Nah, but the son was more of just like calm, like son. Like it was a... Yeah, it was like <laughs> Serena <laughs> Williams, huh? This is hip-hop. Like, yeah, <laughs> like it's so easy. <laughs> <laughs> like, why would we even... Now I'm starting to think maybe they should have got one for that. That, that, was, that was a good explanation. <laughs> right, come on. What was the I'm, next one they missed? Okay, cool. So, Bring the uh, pain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck. In the rain. Method Man song, yeah. Bring the pain. Uh, Good clock. Number 10, wasn't it? 
with clock getting the family guy because it doesn't have a capital i it's just a little television on top so that's sick going on there <laughs> Yeah, so it was, yeah, got some new games on my Xbox, which isn't healthy or pretty. Toronto Blue Jays, Austin Red Sox, and Philadelphia Phillies. Mm. I mean, I've never heard of most of them, but... Any of yeah. them. Again, we went, <laughs> let's make it American. Make yeah, it for sure. You did draw that round. Right. Seven all on that round. So not bad. Because right. if we lost, I might have to draw this round, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I just get warmed up. Just... Now, Ilmac, you're a freestyle boy. Uh, we've had some freestylers <laughs> on before, obviously. Um, the source being one of them. But we've never actually asked, like, as someone who's well-versed in freestyle, <laughs> is there a sort of state of mind you have to go into to get into the freestyle zone? Or could you just do it yeah. like if we asked you now? Desperation. <laughs> desperation, <laughs> desperation, yeah. So you're always in that zone, yeah? Uh, yeah, exactly. Uh, <laughs> I want to uh, be accepted, probably. It's probably <laughs> so I hear that. I hear that. For it. mm. It's one of those things that, uh, for me at least, sometimes, like, the harder you try, uh, the worse it is sometimes. Sometimes you almost have to, like, lean yeah. into not the not caring, and then you kind of catch a wave. Um, right. as far as like preparation beforehand, like this full awkward's broke it down. You should have Ock on here, but this full yeah, awkward's, uh, broke it down a long time ago when I was coming up in the freestyle, like battle scene. Um, cause I was like, yo, this fool is amazing. We had a cypher and we're like on a balcony and he's like rhyming and he's just like, I'll hop off this thousand feet balcony and grow a pair of Falcon wings that I am like, who would think of that right now? And he's like, I don't know. Like I walk down the street and everything I see, I try to turn it into a rhyme and store it in my head. You know, you have your vocabulary, which is words, you know, and then you have your word bank, which is like words you use and that you'll gravitate back to. So it's all about increasing the word bank, you know, and nice. just mm. thinking of words and storing them in the word bank rather than keeping them in the vocab, which you won't Definitely. reach as much. Won't have from the vocab. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Damn. Got a lot of wool kids. You also, also said after balcony, you said, you know, when you're down the street. I don't think you meant to say that. <laughs> you did say that. <laughs> Kamikaze. I'm going to call you Cam. It sounds better. It sounds cooler. Oh, don't, better. please. I mean, you know, Kamikaze is a very cool name. But I'm gonna Can you call me Camo rather than, rather than Cam? I'm going to call you Camo. <laughs> That's... No, I'll call you Camo. All right, Camo. Um, how did how did you st how did you get into like like not not rap necessarily but like rhyming into into sort of like a level above normal rhyming? Do you know what I mean? Like into sort of like multisyllabics and things like that. Like you use them pretty confidently in your music. So when did that become a thing for you? Like how did you pick up on what that was and how that sounded? You know what? Uh, most British kids they start rapping because of grime in it, right? And it tends to be the grime that I listened to at the time didn't really have that much substance in terms of lyrical ability. It was more about the vibe and being yeah, violent and what you were saying mattered more than how you were saying it. But the influence in terms of, like you say, a broader spectrum of rhyming yeah. comes from some British rappers, people like Klashnikov a bit, but, mm -hmm. but not, not massively. But my dad listens to like a lot of hip hop, but like sort of common people like, people like that he put me onto mf doom as well mm. um yeah it's a big one for a lot and it's, it's i'll oh. be honest the multi thing Jeez. especially in the uk i feel like is a foreign influence in it yeah. if i'm being honest um because I was, even if you listen now to what's popping in england like drill man don't do multis in it they just don't yeah. like and because like i said before it's more about what you're saying rather than how you're saying it that matters yeah. and for me it was just about taking the theory of writing hip hop well and putting it into something that was British. Yeah, for sure. And also, Cam, you're you actually you're like a pro footballer as well, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm professional, has, yeah. Has it ever like does there has there ever been like an overlap where you've like been instructed by the club not to rap or not to work within that? You know what I did, but that was me and probably paranoia more so than people within a structure that I worked at. They don't really understand it they just think this guy is trying to be a gangster yeah uh that must be a distraction from football therefore it's a scapegoat if i don't perform properly right do you right. get what i'm saying yeah so i'd have a bad game someone would say well he's a wannabe da -da 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 -da. anyway bad boy blah 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 yeah like but if you actually listen to my music that's not who i am yeah so 
in my head, I kind of taught myself out of combining the two or ever letting the two be in the same space until about two years ago when I thought, you know what, like, fuck it, bro, this is who I am. I'm, I'm glad you're rapping again. What didn't? I, am I mad thinking that I saw you as the face of Pepsi Max recently? Yeah, I did the Christmas advert for them, innit? Yeah. Hey, mm, bro, I, I love fine. seeing you killing it, man. You send me some Pepsi? I know what you mean as well with the... Um the football thing because like when I was doing admin for the garden center group uh Y Vale and um you know I was the training admin for a while and they were like you know it's this or it's the the battle rap and I said you know what dog it's gonna have to be the battle rap <laughs> and they said dog you know because I was getting that's a bit you know I shouldn't really say this but I was getting upwards of 15,000 pounds a year at that job yeah so, <laughs> mad uh, <laughs> All about so I took a I took a ninety percent pay cut to follow my dreams, <laughs> and I haven't. I've never looked back. <laughs> but if I, if if Tom and Darren and Pippa from the training department at head office at Wildwell are watching, then I can still do evenings and weekends. <laughs> <laughs> to them as to what, if, you know, if the ball's in their court, so let's just see how that one goes. But yeah, no, so I can I can relate. Okay, round two <laughs> is called, say what? <laughs> this is where I'm going to give you a title of a rap track, but I've used a synonym for every word in the title, and you have to figure out what is the original song title. I'm so, for so example, if the clue was guard one's throat, that would be protect your neck. neck. Yeah. Okay. Uh, it's no yeah. points. It's just a bit mm. of fun for everyone, all right? This has been a pleasant 24 hours. Great day. Uh, yeah. Huh? Good day, Ice Cube. It was a good day. Correct. Oh, Correct. Oh, Mad villain. Oh, great day. It was a good day. All right. Um, within the venue. In the club. In the club. Yeah, <laughs> 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 okay, okay. Okay. Misplace your body and soul. Lose your Lose yourself. Lose yourself. Lose yourself. <laughs> Lose yourself. In the moment. Music. All right. Get into fisticuffs against authority. Fuck the, fuck police. the police. Fuck the police. Oh, close. Fuck the police. Fight the... Fight the... Fight, fight the, the power. Fight the power. Fight the power. Fight the power. Mm. And then the last one is have sex with law enforcement. Mm. Fuck, fuck the, the police. And that's fuck the police. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that Good round. Fun. Good round. Oh. Hell of a round. Hell of a round. We move on now onto round three. This round is called Count Up. I'm going to give everybody 30 seconds to come up with a setup and punchline which needs to rhyme on a scheme that I and Blees decide and pre-provide. At the end of that 30 seconds, you're going to perform them for Blees to rank from first to worst. Blees, what is the scheme that they're working from today? So the scheme is word on the street. Word on the street. Okay, so you've got 30 seconds, 30 each, three... I want to set up on a punchline from everyone. Three, two, one, go. Mickey Mouse. Evil Mickey Mouse in there. Sounds like orange eating arse. Does it look sideways? Don't want to know. Three, two, one. Holy shit. Time! All right, Kamikaze, what did you get written, please, mate? I heard you were looking for me. That's the word on the street. Don't want to see me pull up, then reverse up the street. No! Oh, my <laughs> days. I ran street with street. No. Oh, reverse in the Jeep. That's what I said. Reverse in the Jeep. Fucking hell. All right. <laughs> nah, I lose the round. I lost. I lost. Oh, I no, 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 no. It's no, he didn't lose. He said, reverse. Yeah, don't worry, because he still got back to go, so I'm sure you'll be fine. No, 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 no. He, he didn't double. Cab, don't admit defeat. Reverse in a Jeep. No, that's fine. None. What have you got? If the word on the street is I'm fly, you must have heard it from a bird in its beak. <laughs> that's funny. That's funny. It's, all right, okay. That must or be. Or you just heard it. Or you just heard it from me. <laughs> 
Elmac, what did you get? Come on, this is the pressure's on now. Come on. You've got no <laughs> All right. So everyone get your expectations right up here because this is Ilmac, freestyle champion, WRC champion, spin the mic probably. I don't know all the ones that he's done. Come on, mate. You are going to fucking smash this round. Go. All right, word on the street is it ain't on me, it's in me. Fuck my shirt and my sneaks. Fuck acapella, I can murder the beat. Just keep it 300 like the Persians and Greeks. Let's go. Woo! All right, give him the thousand. That's annoying. I built it up and then it was about as good as I implied that it would be. Fuck me. That's how it's done. That is how it is done. And Bagnall, what have you got written down? What did you waste your ink with? Uh, Shuffle. The word on the street is you've been working for free. I heard you got fucked like the birds and the bees. Mm. (laughs) Pretty good. That's fire. That's a better bird scheme. It's so annoying that I thought of a are better you? one now when I was just chilling. It's fucking pissed me off. Are you, <laughs> even though this one, even though this one won't count yet, can I say my other one? Yeah, yeah. go on. We got the money in the bag and the purse isn't cheap. Mm. Yeah, that's, that's fine. I would have liked it. But yeah, fucked, fucked it. Energy. Fucked it. I'm gonna give it to please. Whose verse was the sweet est? And who's third? And then please. <laughs> This is nice. Well done. Um, My shirt isn't green. Nice. It's a lie. <laughs> Don't lie to me. He needs to take some personal leave. <laughs> <laughs> well, right. come on. What, who, who's last? I'm sorry, cameraman. Sorry, boy. Yeah. I know. I know. I'll I know. Your, I'll pop your fourth there, dude. And then I'm going to go third. Nan Fierro. Second. Ooh. Bagnall. First. Ilmac. Let's go. Uh, uh, Ilmac was fucking crazy, as expected. Yeah. <laughs> yeah and, uh, what doesn't help is his little shit eating grin that he's now got on his face. <laughs> well, you he's sent nerd, it to me a week a ago. You're cheats. like, hey, man. So <laughs> it's the least I could do. He's a nerd that just cheats. <laughs> I forgot you're on my team. <laughs> <laughs> Here's some things that we got for 4th of July, okay? Someone said, a fork and a knife. Simple. Mm. And a picture is provided of a fork and the knife. <laughs> Someone said, I've got some dirt caught in my eye, which is causing a sty. Mm. Um, on the 4th of July, join me at mine for an exorbitant time from morning till night. They're going to have a party. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh, forcing a rhyme for the 4th of July. I quite like that. It's quite nice and simple. Porsche on my drive, short in supply, quarter to nine, taught me to rhyme, abortionist rights. Jesus. Is that disaster? <laughs> Fourth of July, celebrating celebrating when poor people died. <laughs> Fourth of July, ba- you're basically celebrating when poor people died. That's amazing. What's something that always gets paired with the word rapper? Rapper slash actor. Exactly right. Chance the- Actor. Oh. So it was rapper slash yes. actor, right? <laughs> Tupac, 50 Cent, Roan, uh, Ilmac, you had a small part, no pun intended, <laughs> bodied. Um, but I want all the rappers here to stretch that creative muscle a bit. So I've written a short script that I all want I want you all to perform. Right, here we go. <laughs> so um, interior, day, a smoky bar, Doug, Tex and Flint, three cowboys are playing a game of poker, all right? Doug is going to be Nan Fierro. Uh, no, sorry, Nan Fierro is going to be Doug. Kamikaze is going to be Flint. And Max is going to be Ted. All right? So, who am I? You'll I come in in a bit. You're going to be the, bar, the bartender. Right. Okay. So, <laughs> so a game oh, of poker is happening. All right. So, Doug, if you could start us off, please. <laughs> Just a table read. This is not definite casting, but. Also- this kind of fire, though. Hold on. Well, goddamn. <laughs> Another straight flush. Must be my lucky day. <laughs> yeah. Must be my lucky day. All right, and then that's camera. Hold on just a minute now. <laughs> Those cards are from a different deck. We've been shortchanged. You trying to pull the wool over our eyes just because I'm short? Just because I'm a tiny man? A little, <laughs> tiny, mini, small man? <laughs> oh, Doug. I have a different accent now. That's not it, fellas. That's not it at all. It was that bartender who gave me the cards. Bartender is washing a glass. Well, I'm just a big, stupid asshole. Stinks of ass. <laughs> and doesn't like soap. 
I've never been one for smarts. I found them their cars down a toilet and thought it'd be okay for a hand of pokey. <laughs> okay. Tex? I'm a small, small microman, but at least I'm not as dumb and ugly as this goddamn bartender. <laughs> I think improvisation. <laughs> We can all agree on that. The bartender who has been known to try making love to the local horses right. is indeed the worst of us. Okay. <laughs> I'm off the hook on account of the bartender's idi idiocy <laughs> and bad looks, but I will still shoot everyone here. Doug shoots. I reckon. <laughs> Does this mean I don't get a tip? Ben. Right. Well done, guys. That was really good. Oh, them accents, man. Camera killed the accent. That was incredible. Fucking hell. Yeah. I wasn't expecting <laughs> Max accent. I wasn't expecting It was brilliant, all of them. Tarantino vibes all around, to be honest. <laughs> he was a big influence in the script. <laughs>to round four. Round four. Now, this is always on a specific theme, and before you answer, you have to raise your hand and say, sounds like, and I will choose who gets to answer first. Uh, last week, we did the theme of two-pack songs, but what have we got this week, Mr. Blize? This week, we are doing Legends of Wrestling. Legends of Wrestling. Ooh, I don't know what's fucking wrestling, bro. My what is this we're, thing? We're, yeah, we're, we're, we'll, we'll be even. We'll be even. There's no bro. one with wrestling. You bit, you... I, 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 when I was super I little, know. I have the worst memory, though. When I was 10. Yeah, but they're legends, so some of these do go back to when you were 10. So let's have a test trial now. If you're looking for a wrestler that rhymes with once upon a time in Mexico, just the in Mexico bit, then who's someone who rhymes with in Mexico? I know this. Wait, it sounds like Chris yeah. Jericho. Correct. Okay. Number one, shopkeeper. Or sharp keeper. Sounds like yeah. Bagno. John Cena, no problem. John Cena. Jack. Correct. All right, gang sign. Oh, it sounds like uh, Bagno. Bagno. Yeah. Oh, oh what, what's wrestling me? You've been fucking yeah. right. Mother Nature. Sounds like Bagno. Undertaker. Did you write this fucking round? Yes. Right. Captain Morgan. Sounds like Kama. Randy Orton. Yes, look at that. Yeah. All right. Yes. Nick Plate. Come on, man. Nerds. Huh? Sounds like. <laughs> sounds like. Play. Sounds like. Bagnall. Triple H. Fucking hell, yeah. I, this is mad. All right. Chokehold. Sounds, sounds like. like. Sounds like. Uh, Nan Fierro, I think you were first. That was me, bro. Oh, yeah, they, they haven't got one yet. Stone Cold. I know I was first, but I didn't say it. I just raised my <laughs> hand. Sports Bible. Oh, I've gone fucking blurry again. You. Sports Bible. Uh, Kama. Shawn Michael. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Shawn yes. Michael. I would have also accepted George Michael, the other popular um, <laughs> wrestler. Sports wrestler. A different kind of Part of, of the Generation X, right? Red Army. We'll just deal with me. Sounds with like. Kama. Jeff Hardy. Yes. How the hell? All right, Soul Search. Sounds like. Come on. I don't know. I just don't want them to get it in it. Sounds like. <laughs> oh, no. Sounds like. Sounds like. That's minus one. Sounds like. Liam. Goldberg. Yeah, who the fuck is Goldberg? My, my years on WWF Raw and N64 are Come paying off. I'm telling you that, mate. All right. Yeah. And this is a tricky one. This is number 10. Never skip that part. Never skip that part. Never skip that part. Uh, yeah. Sounds like... Ilmac. Brett the Hitman Hart. Yes! Mm, fire. That was my favorite wrestler as a kid. Quick announcement to make from the Sounds Like team. We officially have official merch, motherfuckers. We ain't had no merch before, but we got some rhyming merch. Uh, first of all, in the form of a, a collection of stickers. Sounds like... Oh, and that's Gordon Ramsay with a Cornish pasty. There's your rhyme. <laughs> and then there's Phil Mitchell as a dill pickle. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's the upper body of Buddy Holly with a cup of coffee. Oh my God. We don't like stickers. That's okay because we got that. And we got that. 
Mm. And, it, and if you don't like that, you fancy a little right in your book. Oh, we got one of them. Nice. And also, big shout out to Kruger for designing and, and drawing all of it. What does it sound like? Sounds like a multi to me. What does it sound like? Sounds like a multi to me. Okay, so we move now on to round five of Sounds Like. It's about to get crazy. La di da, blah be blah, fluffy flower is bar for bar. This is where we pit two players against each other to have a direct rhyme off on a scheme by me, why, please. You'll be paired up with a minute and a half of uninterrupted back to back lines. If you can't continue, then you are disqualified. If you make it through the one and a half minutes, then it will be up to please to hear what you've said and see who's clearly the best. So, Who's going to go first? I think we're going to have Ilmak versus Kamikaze. And we're going to give you a rhyme scheme to work on. So, please, what is the rhyme scheme that we've got for these two fine gentlemen? For these guys, it's trunk of my car. Starting with Ilmak, three, two, one, go. Hey, trunk of my car. This is something, uh, the only thing I thunk of so far was that I might be sure, but I could still dunk on Jabbar. <laughs> <laughs> You can dunk on your bar. I'll tell you, relax, like you just come to the spa. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, if you ever got down on yourself and thought you were nothing, you are. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Something, wait, what was your story again? <laughs> you I was just going to say, run to the bar. Run to the car. Run yeah. to the car, run to the bar. Uh... Uh, uh, I only I'm only even on this show for the love of the art. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, mm. love of the art. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know if it rhymes outside. The park. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Uh, Charlie horse, I just got punched in the arm. Oh, oh. <laughs> he's looking mm. at the arm for inspiration. Yeah, he's punched in the heart. <laughs> I was, uh, it's a sensitive subject, me being short. I was born prematurely and my mom's stomach is scarred. Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> what, a, what a weird note to end on. <laughs> but now you're still here and that's the loveliest part. Mm. Time, time, time. All, right. All right, please. She was wonderful, car. Stop, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> All right, please, come on, boy. <laughs> Kamikaze's lights off. He's stuck in the dark. <laughs> hey. mm. oh, yeah, we'll give it to the boy Ilmac, man. Well played. Being nice. Too Thank smooth, my mind. Too smooth, my mind. To that team. All right, now it's going to be non fie roll first body bag no. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And your rhyme scheme is what? Please, please. Back of the net. Back of the net. That is what's next. I'm going to count you in. Three, two, one. Fierro, go first. Go. Mm. Yo, back of the what? Back of the net. You know. Back of the net. The back of the net is where I fucking look. <laughs> a massive cassette. That's it. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm glad you got that off your chest. That off your chest. <laughs> okay, yeah, fine. Um. Uh, yeah. Thanks. <laughs> thanks. Thanks for respect. <laughs> Thanks for, thanks for respect. Uh, I'm glad you can rap because I'd have you at chess. Mmm. Oh. Yo, I lost 60 pounds. Now I'm no longer gasping for breath. Mm. <laughs> Good, because I think before that, man, you're depressed. <laughs> no, I just manage it less. Uh, <laughs> I swear when we got in here, how'd you just eat? <laughs> 
<laughs> a massive baguette. <laughs> hey, um, actually, yes. <laughs> <laughs> did you know? Did you know that salad's your friend? <laughs> um, maybe if I added some dress. <laughs> Uh, time, 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 time. <laughs> right, please. Fuck. That was a tough one to call, man. I really don't know what way that's going to go. It is really tough, to be fair. Fucking, I love it when it's back and forth, as I always say. Love it when it's conversational yeah. like that. But to be fair, Bagnall was smoother, man. He was quicker. Yeah, I was going to say, he was more consistent with it. He was a bit smoother, wasn't he, bro? Yeah, I'm going to go Bagnall on that, but no. All right. All right. I love that. No, no, I love that. That's fine. Bagnall right on, right on. I've gone through the scores. It's very, very, very close, right? The winning team have 28 points. And Il, what is it? Ilero. <laughs> I'm going to prep that. Ilero. Ilero have 26 points, which means that the winning right. team. Wait, is... three point finals, winner versus winner right now. Oh, this is pathetic, Ilmac. Just three points. Up, right? Come on. <laughs> I called the winner v winner before I knew I wasn't winning. Look, I was willing I, to no, put my ball on lost, the table lost, before. I, I will happily. For three for, points. I will happily do winner versus winner for the victory of the episode. I mean, it's your it's your points that you're that you're risking here. It's, it's my graveyard, but I know that we won by twenty eight points. They had twenty six points, and I will take Ilmac in a final one. And no, I'll you're no, say in a fight. No, I'll take him. I'll take him. Do it for hip hop. Right. We'll have the we'll have the the champions of champions. All right, we'll do it. Ilmac versus Ilbag. So please, should we do should we do another tricky one that's like six syllables or something like that? Like um. Like uh, Condoleezza Rice or something like that. No, nah, because then you've got to be precise. Uh, well, who do you want to start, Bags? Wait, are we doing Condoleezza Rice? Yeah. Yeah, let's go. All right. Um, <laughs> right. I'm, I'm, glad, I'm glad you've done that. I'm glad you've chosen that. Uh, Ilmat can go first. All right. You've got a minute this time, not a minute and a half, one minute. I'm going to count you in three, two, one. Condoleezza Rice, go. Condoleezza Rice. Yeah, you might have edged us the first round, but you're not going to beat us twice. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm not gonna beat this guy. I'm not gonna beat this. Corner, he's so guy. he's so dumb. He got his phone wet, and how he got the thing to dry was put it on a piece of rice. Um, <laughs> oh my god! I thought yeah, I thought different I thought types, you got to freeze types. it right. <laughs> Yo, uh, I could do this uh, on mute. I I don't need this mic. Uh, mm. I don't need this mic, right? Don't, don't <laughs> you even try. Don't you even try. I don't probably need this mic. This guy looks like a snack and I've got to eat tonight. So... <laughs> mm. that's, that's eating. I've that's never seen bite. that gang side. Fire. Uh, oh, five seconds left, come on. In case I disconnect from the Wi-Fi, I got the eat tonight. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you you love like, really lame shows like Drake and Josh be all right. <laughs> terrible, terrible. Um, it's too difficult for me. You're speaking my love language. Language. It's in aphrodisiac. <laughs> <laughs> time, 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 time. Drake and Josh is fire. To be fair. Well, what, what, can you repeat what that was, Bagno? Josh and Drake be all right. What was it? Drake and Josh be all right. Uh, I don't know. I was constantly surprised. Drake, Drake and Josh be all right. Uh, I don't know. It was a, it was a, it was a massive stretch, and I tried. You know, dropping lean and sprite. It was a yeah, that's good. massive that's stretch and it was a massacre. Right, okay. Who who gets the three points from that, please? Ill Mac. Ill Let's Mac. Let's go. Ill Big Dubsky's in the chat. You lost Big the Mac. In the chat. You lost it for you and you lost it for Kama. Let's go. But Kama, would you not respect would you not respect the effort? I faced the final boss and I lost. Do I do I respect you losing? <laughs> <laughs> we, what, we, what, what we built together, bro. You, you yeah, sacrificed yeah. the dub he for your ego to just be went through it all the way. I, look, yeah. I nearly beat disaster. Arguably, beat nearly. I right. beat shuffle. I've had a really. Good, I thought this is a what, different. Oh, it's a whole you know different what, yeah? game. You know what? You're done better than me, and you're done better than me. So, <laughs> thank you. Congratulations to I guess Elero. Uh, <laughs> you win two middle fingers up from everyone else. <laughs> hey. hey. Just before I we feel like I feel like Jeremy Lin with the Raptors when they won the championship. <laughs> <laughs>
Just before we finish, we're going to have a look through the audience's suggestions for uh, 4th of July. Morecambe and Wise, someone said. Mm, that's amazing. Someone else has said Territorialize. That's very good. Anyone said Lord of the Flies? Wow. No, I just that's did. Awesome. Literally, yeah. someone just did that. Second. I did that. What on the, on the chat? Lord of the flies, all the supply. Yeah, exactly. What it's season five. is uh, Rick and Morty? It's five. Yeah, five. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Only four more till it's nine. <laughs> what are you thinking, please? Morecambe and Wise, was it right? Someone said yeah, Morecambe and Wise. There was one earlier that was who said, who said it's basically celebrating when poor people die? That's the best <laughs> oh, one. Oh, yeah. yeah. I did. So I win again. Let's go. <laughs> So our multilinguist of the week is Nan Fierro. Uh, if you think you can do any better, then leave your rhyme in the comments or on our Twitter, and we'll have a look through some of them on our next live show. Congratulations and thanks to everybody at home for watching. Thanks to our guests, Bagnall, Nan Fierro, Kamikaze, and Ilmac. Make sure to follow hey. us on Twitter, YouTube, and Instagram. It's at Sounds Like Show. And be sure to join us in two weeks' time, and make sure to watch our previous episodes on our YouTube. Everyone else's socials are in the, uh, in the description below. Uh, wait out for our merch. It's going to be on the on the shop soon, so keep an eye out for that. Thank you, everyone, and good night. Hey. Thanks for having me. What are some of your favorite rhymes or one of your favorite rhymes that you've ever heard, be it through battle rap, rap tracks, or, or your own work, something you came up with that you're most proud of? My favorite bar that I've ever wrote. You get like a scroll out. Is, uh... No, 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 no. <laughs> Do you know what? It's always been my favorite bar that I've ever wrote. Was always. It, uh, um, the reversing with the Jeep. Was that it? Nah, <laughs> unfortunately not. That was second. That's yeah. second. <laughs> uh, no, it's um, to put my city on the map is exactly what I want. I want to help LC, like the glasses on the Mont. Mm. Yeah, nice, nice, that's beautiful. And what for context, uh, oh, LC is my city, Leicester City. So LC, Le Mont, big L, yeah, yeah, yeah. he wears glasses, you get it. Mm, LC. That's fire. All right, Nan, what's yours? I also said, um, super califragilistic espialidocious. I'm fat. <laughs> 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 <laughs>